Hello, this is Mark G Dog. I've got another Flight One video for you. Today we'll be talking about the built in OSD for the millivolt and the revolt OSD. So basically, here's where you configure that. And we're going to see where it says craft name and pilot name here in the config. I'll show you where that is displayed on the OSD. So here's your OSD. We'll be using the internal OSD type. This refers to your actually your camera type. Do you have an NTSC camera or a PAL camera? That is important. If you don't know, just put it on auto. And here, there's three different kinds of font. Uh, this is the one that I like. And then you've got two other ones. Whatever you like, you can try them out. And then we go to the OSD menu. See here, this is how I have my OSD set up. The, each little rectangle is a widget. So each little rectangle you click, and then you can select what you want to put in it. If you have some, something in there that you don't want to take it out, you click none. So let's just start here in the middle. Let's just kind of go over these. So none is nothing. Pilot name is what I showed you there on the configuration tab. You put your pilot name and it'll show it there. Craft name arm is in the configuration tab. Arm time is from the time you arm the motors and the timer starts. Milliamp battery bar, this requires a current sensor and it's a bar that'll show up on the screen. Well, that kind of looks like a battery. A volt, and it's based on the milliamps consumed. The voltage battery bar is a bar that looks like a battery. It's based on your voltage. Kind of shows you a rough gauge of how much battery is left. Voltage is the pack voltage. Milliamps consumed. Again, this is based off of a current sensor. Shows you how many milliamps you used. RSSI, based off your receiver. Crosshairs is a little, little crosshair, like a little box. Current draw, again, this is based off a of current sensor, so much drawing right now. Voltage per cell, this will show you the total pack voltage divided by the number of cells. So give you an average cell voltage. Just, uh, this is what I use. These are all based off of BL Heli 32 ESC telemetry. So you have to have that a BL Heli 32 ESC hooked up and set up for this and it'll tell you your RPMs and your current for each individual ESC. Throttle percentage is where your stick's at, your throttle stick. Max amp draw shows you the peak amp draw that you had. Again, this requires a current sensor. Current profile. This is the profile set up in the PID tuning page. You can set up three different profiles, and this is just show you a, a number. I believe it's like P1 it shows, just to remind you what profile you're in. Current VTX channel. This is based off of smart audio. You have to have your smart audio hooked up, and I'll show you that. Arm status. This shows you armed or disarmed. Percent milliamps used. Again, this is based off a of current sensor, and I'll show you how many milliamps have been consumed in your flight. And launch angle. This one will show you the angle that your quad's at. So when you're in launch mode, you can always launch at the same angle. As of 1.62, is still uh, not working perfectly yet, but it's coming soon. So what you would do, you just click one of these that you want there, hit select, go, oh shoot, I don't like my crosshairs there after you looked at it in your goggles, and you can either move it or you just hit none, select, and to say none, but you're not, that means it's taken away and it'll be blank. Then when you're all done, you hit save and exit. Plug in your battery in your ship and take a look and see how it looks. You can also change these with your battery plugged in. Again, here's where you enter your pilot name and your craft name to be displayed on your OSD. Now I'm going to show you something else. This is a feature that I requested and I really appreciate them adding it in. Uh, it's called clear screen mode. So what that does is you can set that up on a switch and all of your OSD data will be removed from the screen. Uh, when I race, I like my screen to be blank. I don't really care what my battery voltage is because you got to run anyway. So I have this set up on a switch. So when my, sh my ship is unarmed or disarmed, it's sitting on the blocks and I can see my uh, name. So I know it's my ship and the goggles I'm looking at and my battery voltage. So I know my pack's charged. And then as soon as I arm, the screen OSD features go away. So all I'm looking at are gates. I hope that tutorial was helpful. Thank you.